Hey guys, in this video, I will show you how we can fix a controller PS5, PS4 controller is not working on MB 2K25. So without further ado, let's get started. First, first of all, if the controller is not working and is connected via cable or uh, via Bluetooth and it shows that it's connected, what I suggest you to do here is to disable all the peripherals on your computer. So if you're using, I know, uh, if you connected uh, two controllers, if you're using steering wheels, uh, VR, VR or something like that, try to disable all of them and just uh, leave your one controller connected and look if the problem persists and if your controller is working or not, because sometimes it can conflict with each other and it uh, uh, cannot uh, continue, right? So first do that. And then if it's still not working, what I suggest you to do here is to press on the Steam icon on the top left, go to settings. On settings, you need to go to controller tab. Then you need to look if the controller is connected. And then if using PS4, PS5 controller, make sure that the PlayStation controller support is enabled here. And, and also make sure that idle gamepad shutdown timeout is on ever because on default is 15 minutes. So this means after 15 minutes, the con uh, controller should uh, disable, right? So make sure uh, this option is enabled and look if the problem persists. If the problem persists, go to library, go to MB2K25, to right click on it, go to properties, then go to controller here and change input. Uh, usually, uh, it's on use def uh, default settings. Try to then uh, select disable Steam input and look if the problem persists and also uh, enable Steam input and look if the problem persists. Uh, next up, if controller still uh, still not working after you apply all these changes, what I suggest you to do here is to open a browser and then you need to go to DS4 windows and ds4-windows.com and download uh, the software, right? Just hit download then press download here and save it to your uh, computer right so let's go on the downloads and uh, save it here then what i suggest to do here is to uh, extract uh, these four windows so downloads uh, here go to uh, this four exe file extract it all uh, to your computer so let's go with a uh, again downloads folder and then go to ds4 windows uh, select ds4 windows cxc file uh, it really doesn't matter what you select here then uh, select if using ps4 controller use this if using ps5 use this if using both select just both close and then just uh, connect your controller via Bluetooth at, uh, and it should appear uh, on this list here. So if I press controller, uh, it should appear here. And after you connect via Bluetooth or uh, connect it with your USB device, it should appear here. It shows your controller name, battery life, and then it should work for you, right? And that's pretty much it. So if I help you out, please press like button and subscribe for more. Yeah.